Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Deidre Gamers what Pokemon White 2 Randomizer Nuzlocke in the oh, smacking my mic there. <laughs> in the last episode we got to the Flacity Ranch and we got our starter and we got lots of good stuff going on. So before we get started, let's have a quick team recap. We have Serpentine, the Melotic who is rocking the lightning rod ability, it got it to level 10. Then we have Lever, based on Mr. Lever, and unfortunately I, I, put a, I put a little disclaimer in the last episode, I called him uh, Roguish Let's Plays, it's Roguish Roleplay. So go check him out, but we got Lever the Drift Blim, who has the Adamant Nature with a Water Veil, rocking Constrict, Minimize, Astonish and Gust, Serpentine has Water Gun Wrap, Water Spot and Refresh, forgot to mention that. Then we have our starter, Sticky, the uh, Guts Bound Duskull, with Lin, Nightshade, Disable and Foresight. And then we have Kathy with Hydration, Fake Out, Scratch and Growl. And Kathy was a pain in the ass to let trade up, honestly, because she didn't learn anything really that useful. But she learned Scratch, but she started off with Fake Out and that was it. So we need to go off and find um, the Herdia. The Herdia wanders somewhere back here. Let's have a look. I don't think we're able to get any more Pokemon for now because this is still considered Flossessy Ranch. Oh, I haven't seen you before. Would you mind sparring with me? I think he's like a he's like a janitor, but he's like in the he's just like sweeping the grass, you know, casual. He's got a Magneton. That's not that is not good. So level six Magneton though, so maybe, maybe we'll be okay. Um, okay, I just got Sonic Boom. That's, that's, that's really bad. <laughs> Honestly, thankfully we did take it out though. We've got no worries here. It's got a nose pass. That's fine. We can go back and we can heal with the lady as well. So it's got slow start. Oh my god. Good. <laughs> At least it hasn't got sturdy. Serpentine coming in, rocking is about, and rocking is the word of the day apparently. Um, so today, guys, we're gonna give you i um, I'm gonna give you a question, and that question is because I don't know when this video is going up. <clears throat> um, right now it is. October 15th, we're exactly one month away from Sun and Shield, and if this, if this episode doesn't go up until after Sun and Shield is out, I hope you're all enjoying Sun and Shield. Uh, oh, here, I'll share something good with you. Oh, thank you. Um, but I'm going to go with, if, what is your, if you could be from any Pokemon region, what region would you be from? Um, that's actually kind of a hard question for me. I love Johto. I love the atmosphere of Johto. I kind of like Hoenn though. Hoenn's just got like a really nice atmosphere. This is, oh yeah, I forgot there was Suicune's here. I wouldn't have been able to get it anyway because I can't catch... Can't catch Suicune because it's a legendary, so... Oh well. <laughs> Sucks to be me. You're sure I'm looking to have run into someone as strong as me. Um, But yeah, I'd probably say I maybe Hoenn? Just uh... Jesus Christ. Just to have some some uh, tropical fun. I could catch myself a Mudkip, because me and Mudkip are like that. <laughs> What's he doing? And Water Gun was disabled. Oh, well, that's not nice of you, because I can't hit you now. <laughs> um, I can go into Sticky, but I'm kind of scared of going into Sticky, because it is a ghost type, so I am weak to ghosts. But it's also weak to ghosts, but I don't have any exactly what I was worried about. We took that like a champion though, so... Plus it's got Protect. So yeah, I'd probably say Hoenn. Maybe... Maybe Galar, because once we actually see the whole of Galar, we've seen a map of Galar, but we haven't seen the whole region yet. Because I am from England. I am a Brit. I'm half... Actually, I'm half British. I'm half English, half Spanish. But... They, re they, they just really want to really, really push that disable, don't they? Um, let's go to Kathy then. 
Kathy, I, I don't think Kathy's gonna survive, honestly. But she could, I guess. She might do all right. I've never used a glide me out before and I didn't think I was ever going to, but apparently I am. Kathy, wake up. Kathy? Kathy? We've talked about this. That's Sabri and a pretty bitch. <laughs> okay, uh, I guess it was a little like it's everyone to you. Yeah, you were. You felt the wrath of Kathy. X attack. Okay, well, it's not really that great. Um, but yeah, just let me know in the comments what is your, the region you would. Oh, rope! <laughs> Did you hear that just now? So yeah, just let me know in the comments what region you'd be from. I think I'd either be Johto or Hoenn or Galar. I think those are my turn. I don't want to live in Kanto. I'm sick of Kanto. Like, sick of seeing Kanto. <clears throat> but. Maybe, um, yeah, maybe Gala, because I, I like the look of Gala. The thing I love about Gala is the fact that it looks like very Victorian, but also modern at the same time. So I'm kind of excited to see it. Yep. <laughs> that cry, we, you found it. What a relief. Okay, I'll go call its trainer. So you stay here with it. <laughs> you little pissed. I'm a member of the group that strikes fear into the hearts of those who stand before it. Team Plasma. You heard of it? Yes. That's right, we're the righteous group that tried to conquer you over two years ago, back, in order to liberate Pokemon. However, fools will never understand us. Still, first, I, I lost, I got lost chasing Heredia, and now some nosy kick got me. All of this is your fault. Take this. Frustration. I thought I battled him. Okay, I'll use this opportunity to retreat for now. He just smacked me with frustration. <laughs> <laughs> For some reason, I thought I battled him, but obviously not. Erdia! What made you go all the way back here? Well, at any rate, I'm really grateful, you know, for your help, Yoto. You're awfully calm about this. Your Pokemon might have been gone for good. Take better care of it. You, I. Uh, shut up. Hmm, I wonder if something happened to him. It looks like he's afraid of blue Pokemon. Come on, Herdia, everyone's waiting. Let's go home. Uh, can I go with you? No. Not allowed. Not allowed. Alright, so we need to go back to... We need to go back to the, um... Uh, to Aldo and, tra and do some training, even though we just basically had our training. Kind of scared about, um... <clears throat> Oh, it looks like you've delivered the time to your friend. Hmm. You were only a mo a moment, but you and your Pokemon have grown. Why? I could almost mistake you for someone else. Well then, instead of training you, I would like you and your Pokemon to give me a hand. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I'm just gonna speed this up for a second, because I do want to go and heal. Get my team up. Healed. Um... Pokeballs, I have one, so it's good. I'll buy 19 of them. I'm gonna buy... I can't buy that many. I'll, I won't buy any potions. I've got four potions on me, so if I need them, I, I have them. Obviously, the worry is obviously losing Pokemon, so um, I will go through all these houses. I didn't do that last time, but I will go through all the houses after I've done this bit and just like see if there's any items that I'm missing at X speed. Okay, that's kind of cool, I guess. If we ever needed... Uh, Item. Oh yeah, this bit. I always forget about this. This is where um, Kel you take Keldeo and it learns that move. And it changes form. I don't think we can do anything with it though. I mean, I mean get, uh, you can't even fish or anything here. So, okay, let's just get back down there real quick. Actually, I forgot about that to be honest. Oh, are you going to help train that person, sir? Really? But that trainer looks really tough. That's right. Hey, this trainer may be tough, but you can learn from losing as well. More importantly, haven't I been telling you to just to enjoy Pokemon battles? So Drew, please be their opponent. I'll show you what is cool about my Pokemon. I'm kind of scared because you have to fight both of them.
Why is it a man tag? Okay. Um, I haven't got anything for you. I mean, I could use Rap, I guess, but... We're gonna go into, um, Weaver. Oh, well, that was a crit. And we got flinch hacks. Okay, cool. Level 11. Nice. I need to get all the teach me some more things. Well, I hope you know it's ready. First, we'll have to heal your Pokemon, Drew. No, I'm alright. You don't need to do that. Some girl battle. Some, some girl. Some Pokemon battles are decided by the type matchups, are they? And she has, what does she have? A Glaceon. Okay. I might be okay to stay in then because... Because... Glaceon is a special attacker, so... So we're just gonna war got it. <clears throat> A couple times. Oh, it's survived one health. That's. Why are you gonna listen to time matchup like this? I mean, yeah, you did so. That was truly a rousing battle. I could tell that you and your Pokemon were enjoying themselves as well. How about it, Drew? Pokemon types are very important in battle, aren't they? Water is strong against fire, fire. Yeah, we know that. That was right through and through. But listen, when a Pokemon uses moves and matches its type, the move becomes more powerful. Let's use those hard-working Pokemon. And Melotic, you did a great job for Drew. Thank you. Alright. Oh yeah, this guy. This is just like, it's like a bonus thing and it's kind of cool. But I've never really, like, done all of them. I did actually try and get all of them, but I just... Um... Sorry, one second. I've got to send a message. So basically, it just gives you... Medals, depending on different tasks. Okay, hold up. I'll be back in a second. Alright, sorry about that everyone, I had to send some messages. Um, so, yeah, okay, let's go. Uh, Drew, as for the newly opened Pokemon Gym in the Spacious City, I heard a new gym leader has arrived there. You should go and test how strong you've become. Okay. Let's go through these houses then. I need to do this in the Spacious City too, but I might do that off camera. Uh, anything? A oh, potion, that's always good. Okay, so just a potion then by the looks of it, which is fine. Drew, Alder, leave me alone. I'm trying to get this. <laughs> oh my god. There's so many like random cutscenes at the start of this game. It's very intense. Excuse me, I've got to tell you something important. First, take these. What are you giving me? Oran berries. Okay. Those are Oran berries. If you give one to your Pokemon, it's safe to be restored. What's more, you can give your Pokemon a berry to hold. It's like, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Like I said, I'm not gonna read everything, but I'll read some of it. Alder, shut up. Thank you. <laughs> I've only got like a certain amount to record today, so time to record today, so I was just like trying to get through this as quickly as possible. It was only supposed to be a half an hour episode, but I spent about like 10 minutes like replying to messages, so.
Alright, so what we got here? Okay. Hello, I'm Clyde, the guy from the Traders of Chance Pokemon Gyms. Thank you for uh, taking on the gym. Take this as come over to your debut. Fresh water, go awesome. Pokemon Gyms are facilities for testing trainers in. But simply, if you can defeat the gym leader, it means you're a really good trainer. If you run out of Pokemon that can fight during the battle, you lose. Yeah, I'll be dead. And the run will be over. So having a lot of Pokemon with you might work to your advantage. You must be the challenger. Welcome to a special city Pokemon gym. I'm Sharon, the gym leader. Hmm, well maybe I'd better say that I became the gym leader. More importantly, we need to prepare before welcoming you to the gym. We have a challenger, you two. Take your places. If we defeat these two, then I'll, I'll be your opponent. Alright, okay. Sharon saw potential in me and made me the gym this trainer in this gym. Uh, Youngster Pedro, who has a Cacturn. That's not a good matchup, honestly. That is actually a really bad matchup. So we're gonna get to Lever. Sorry about this, everyone. I really apologize for this. Okay, so leave a crystal level 11. I really apologize for that, everyone. Um, sometimes these things happen. And honestly, Lever could actually stay in. So level 12, okay, also awesome. you're strong, so I should say your Pokemon are strong. You can defeat the girl too, you can charge a gym leader. Okay, so now I'll share the things I learned from Charon. It's got Charmander, okay, that's a really good start, honestly. I hope we're gonna be okay in the gym. So we got a couple of Pokemon on level 12. I might have to do some off-screen chaining. And a Maractus, okay. Um, honestly, I'm not scared of it. Honestly, we need to do a lot of training, make sure everything's staying up. Or did it just do growth? Yeah. So, okay, we're doing, we're doing okay. We are doing okay. We need some better moves on our mons, honestly, because like all my mons, like have they ever okay starting moves, but the the one who has the most variation is Lever. 
Okay, so the only Pokemon who needs training up is Kathy, really. <laughs> I do kind of want to start with... For no, it's really only one. Ugh. I hate that, like... Okay, you're pretty good, but can you beat Sharon? This is a... This is your first gym times. This is my first Pokemon battle as a gym leader. Let's both do our best and have a battle we can be proud of. I love the gym leader music in this game, but I hate the fact that when you get to the last Pokemon, it changes the music because the gym leader music is actually on point. He's got two Pokemon. Sharon, who has a beautifully. It's got pressure. Okay, that's not great. Uh, I'm going to stay in. Unless it's got Absorb, which it might. Yep. We might be... Oh, uh, okay. We tanked that, though. So... I have to choose the moves. I see you're a powerful opponent. And a vanillish. Okay, well that's actually okay. I don't like this. I hate this music. This music really irritates me because it just happens and it ruins the atmosphere of the gym for me. Okay, we just gotta be careful. That was a crit. Even though it's probably not gonna do that much. It's got uproar. And uproar. Yeah, uproar does a lot of damage. And I'm kind of scared of uproar, so... Um, you know what? I'm gonna switch into... I'm kind of scared of doing this. I'm actually scared of doing this. It does calm down. See, like, he's calmed down now. St I was got astonished. No! No, 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 no. Okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Damn it. I think we're going to lose a Mon. I feel like we're going to lose a Mon. I didn't think he was going to have... It's about astonished, Okay. That's too close, that's too close, that's too close. I don't like it, I don't like it. I gotta switch, I have to switch into Lever, into uh, Serpentine. Okay. Jeez, okay, she wants to learn water pulse. Oh, he wants to learn water pulse, sorry. What time are we on? Okay. That was scary. <laughs> this is what, uh That battle has made me feel really glad you were my first challenger as a gym leader. I give you this honor, the strength you and your Pokemon showed. So we got our first badge. I think this is the basic badge. Here's your first gym badge, the basic badge. This is an important milestone. With this badge, Pokemon up to level 20 will obey you, including traded Pokemon. And I want you to take this. We got Work Up. Which is okay, I guess. You can teach your Pokemon the move Work Up. When you're, you use Work Up while battling, it raises the user's attack and special attack. By the way, TMs can be used as many times as you want. In the Unova region, there are 8 Pokemon gyms and 8 gym badges. If you're a trainer, you could collect them, all of them. That will make it easier to fill the pages of the Pokedex as well. Yes, two years ago, Pokedex in hand. I left on a journey with my friends. <clears throat> awesome. So we somehow managed to get our first gym badge. Hey! 
How was it? How did your Pokemon with Jimmy to go? Oh, it wasn't the basic badge. Wow, amazing. And you just set off on your journey with your Pokemon. You definitely have potential as a trainer. I'm sure of it. This is from me. It's a TM for the re return. Return's going to be a really good move to have. Unfortunately, it's not going to do that much just yet. When a Pokemon knows return, the movie, it, uh, the more it gets along with the trainer, the more powerful the move is. Still, that's Sharon. Bianca, it's been two years, hasn't it? Oh, wow. What's up? I thought I, it would be a good idea to register each other in the cross transceiver. Now you can communicate with me in your cross transceiver. M me too. Hi there, Drew. I'm Professor Juniper. Bianca told me you accepted the Pokedex. Thank you so much. Thanks to you, we will all know more about Pokemon and be able to get along with them even better. Hi, Professor Juniper. It's really interesting over here. There are so many Pokemon we couldn't prove were here two years ago. Thank you for going so far so far for this errand, Bianca. And Sharon, how are you, are you enjoying being a gym leader? Professor Juniper, it's been a long time. I'm glad you're doing so well. The gym leader position is very tough. If I had my usual partners, Oh, Sharon, poke battles that come down to the wire will make your gym leader who deepens the bonds between your, your challengers and their Pokemon, right? It'll be fine. Sharon's a new gym leader and the system Pokemon prefer- I'm an assistant Pokemon, Drew's a new trainer, but we always have Pokemon by our sides. That's right, Bianca. Our world is a world where we live with Pokemon. Everyone, keep that in mind as you pursue your dreams with your Pokemon. The Pokedex may be important, but first you enjoy your journey and with your Pokemon to their heart's content. Okay. Hey, Drew, if it's in Professor Juniper Cool, if you talk to her on the Crossroads show, she'll violate the completeness of your Pokedex and tell you a lot about how a Pokemon evolved. And you can call this too, of course. I'll tell you how you, well you and your Pokemon are getting along, okay? Bianca makes a good point. I'll tell you what I know about Pokemon abilities and type matchups. I just want to end the episode, to be honest. Are you the gym leader? One, two, three, let's battle! You look like a tough trainer. Understood, please come into my gym. What was that a week? I'm definitely not going to take you- I'm definitely going to take you down. Being a gym leader is even harder than I imagined. The next thing is to make it so you can use the sea gear. Like, oh god, shut up. Sorry about this, everyone. I am just trying to- <laughs> Sure. Alright, so basically the sea gear is just something to do with the button screen. Okay, okay so we're going to go to the floor side. And with that, I am going to end the episode off here. So thank you very much for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed the episode, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys. <laughs>